What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idle Heroes, and today we're going to be talking about something that has surprisingly really hit me in the comments in our videos this week. So we've talked about next week's shelter event being pretty good. There's quite a few new players kind of constantly streaming into Idle Heroes, and a lot of people not understanding the events quite, quite the best. So I think what today we're going to do... We're gonna make this pretty much like our overall shelter guide. We are of course going to talk about next week's event because the big thing a lot of people are commenting in my videos and sending me messages like, Barry, you gotta tell them, the Fiona, the Fortress Priest, we can't get her, there are no four stars in the Fortress Faction. Well, there are substitutes that you use in those certain situations because there's like one in every faction that pretty much doesn't have four stars of the correct faction. So there is a way to get it done, don't worry. Don't, don't panic, you can get Fiona next week. So we're going to make a nice little infographic up, we're going to talk about it and let you guys know who you need as substitutes because in this situation, just for example, Fiona, she's a priest, there's no priest, so instead you use things like Sierra and Time Mage. So hopefully you guys enjoy this one, let's jump right into it. <laughs> So with the upcoming shelter mission, the big question I've been getting, like I said before, is when we take a look at this, you immediately see Fiona. Well, there's actually no priests in that faction. And there's a couple other scenarios in about three factions that have this same issue. I believe Shadow is the only faction who does not have this issue. And that is normally you need four stars of the same class that the hero you're swapping for. The problem being, like I said, there's three classes or three factions that don't have that class for every single class, with the exception of Shadow. So let's jump into our chart. Let's take a look at it. I'll show you what is good because let's be honest, there's a couple of heroes you definitely want to pick up. You definitely want to pick up an Ignis this week coming up, and you probably want to pick up an Ithaqua as well. Now, the Ithaqua is a little bit more of a do you need her? Do you already have a sword flash? If you already have a sword flash, you probably don't need an Ithaqua. Are you building an Ithaqua Delacium PvE army? And then, of course, you do have Fiona. Fiona can be in a great help for Sealand 25 pushes. Those shields are great. She's just like an all well-rounded support hero. Not like anything top, top tier, but very solid hero. Gloria, eh, is what it is. Like I said, Tara, definitely don't pick up. And then, of course, lastly, we do have Aspen. Uh, you might pick him up if you are looking for uh, copies, you know, to build them for next month with the next Transcendence Hero coming out. It will be Aspen. So let's jump on over to the chart. Okay, so this right here is my little infographic I put together. Shelter Mission Guide for 2021. So one thing was really interesting. I noticed I have all like the kind of master files for all the factions and everything. That's why I have all these cute little avatars. All that fun stuff. One thing I noticed was the Shadow Faction was listed as this moon. So I don't know if number one it was originally supposed to be that before it was the Skull. Or two, if it's going to be this in the future, I don't know. Maybe it's something like they don't want skulls and stuff. But then again, you look at all, you look at everybody. You have one, two, three, four, like five skeletons in the shadow faction for four stars. So I don't know. But just note, this is shadow. It's just I didn't have the master file for shadow. I had this one instead, and I I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. But let's go over, and this is going to be a good test to see if I can actually remember all the names for all the factions, starting with the, the forest faction. So forest faction has three different priests, an elder, uh, Thale, and Zekis. So those are great. But what they don't have is they don't have any mages. So any of these that you see with a red border means these are the substitute for any type of shelter mission. So if there's ever a mage like, say, Gloria, uh, well, you can just use any of these copies here. Nice and easy. Fixes the problem very easily. And uh, yeah, you're pretty much good to go. Is Gloria a mage? I think Gloria's a mage. Uh, so this week, you might need to use these. They double for both the priest and any mages that hit shelter. For warriors, you have Kargath and Chief. For ranger, you have Windwalker. And for assassin, oh no. Headstriker and Grey Eye. Those are the two that are going to go for there. So not too bad. Abyss also has the same problem. So you have Roge and Norma for priests. You have Destroyer and Illyria for your mages. You have warriors, which are... Tanner, 
can't remember an Immolatus. So this is where we come into the issue in the Abyss Faction. The Abyss Faction doesn't have any Rangers. So Akasha, which is an Assassin, is doubled as the one you use whenever there is a Ranger in the Shelter missions. Coming on over to Fortress, same exact problem right away. There are no Priests as four stars in the fortress faction so instead you're going to use time mage and sierra which are mages and are used for the mage faction or mage class as well for warrior we have storm hood christian and iron bambi for rangers we have liquor and lmo2 and for assassin we have roy over to the Shadow Faction, they don't have any of these problems. They literally have at least one of every single class, which make, makes things a lot, lot easier. So, we have Glenn for Priest, Deathsworn for Mages. We have Nightmare Knight. I can't remember. And... Oh my god, I'm totally blanking on the warrior names here. Oh my goodness, I thought I could do this. I was like, this is going to be a test for me. Um, I, For some reason, I'm just blanking on both of these guys' names. Oh, I feel so bad. Over in Ranger, we... Uh, actually, I forget another one too. Gabagbo. No, Gabagbo and Lamb are the two Rangers. Then Assassin, we have Bone Carver. So... There's a couple things to take away from this chart right here. Number one is... Don't worry. Just don't worry. If you see any of these where it's like, oh no, there's no mage, there's no ranger, there's no priest in these factions, don't worry because there's still a class or really shards that can be used. You just have to know which ones to save up because you should be trying to save up your four star shards to make sure you can do the shelter missions, especially on an early game account. Now, there's another thing that I want to mention here is any of these that have like a single hero like a single hero that qualifies for it what i would do beyond just saving up your four stars i would probably try to save specific copies like if you do profit orbs and you don't really need all the food right away i would be tempted to save some of these up just to make sure you can get them because i've actually gone events on my free to play where I just keep pulling my four star shards out and I'm not getting those heroes. So if you do manage to get some of them, even in your bag, I would be tempted to lock them down, especially the week before. Uh, now, you don't maybe need to keep them forever, but the week before, once you know what heroes are going to be in the shelter mission, I think that would be a really good time to lock them down. Make sure you save the copies and uh, just plan ahead. So let me know what you guys think. Apologies on some of those names like Nightmare Night. I, I, I just, for some reason, the Shadow Faction, I was just completely blanking right there. And it feels bad because I, I wanted that to be my challenge to see if I could actually remember all the four stars and five star heroes. I was close. I was really close. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this one. Let me know what you guys think. Hopefully, you guys get Shelter Mission taken care of next week. See you guys next time.